guys instead of harvesting red apple size bell pepper we harvest this one infested bell pepper so there are things there are things there are lessons that I will share to you today because today is a special day that you will learn a lot from this episode What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's the episode 5 of this bell pepper series. Now today's video, instead of we are going to harvest this one, this apple sized bell pepper, but suddenly there were events or things that didn't want it to happen this way. But our bell peppers supposed to be a size as apple infested with a fruit fly So yesterday, as I posted on Facebook, as I posted on YouTube, there are a lot of subscribers and followers out there who reached out and wanted to help us, suggested us sprays, insecticides, and I immediately bought a spray at the agri shop, and then I immediately spray it on the pet bottle and then hang it uh, under the mango tree so that the pet or uh, this fruit fly will stick to that pet bottle and then immediately we can save the next generation
Well, it's supposed to be, it is already maturity level of this bell pepper. It's about uh, probably four days from now, three days from now. It will turn red from green, it will turn red, but sadly guys, it will not happen. It's because fruit fly will inject the egg and then it become a larvae it will damage all over inside and then boom it will drop so guys this is the reason why I am very disappointed. Well, a lot of us learn from episode 1 until episode 4. But I will share to you my experience during the episode 1. Let's go back to episode 1. Episode 1, I learned a lot that um, in order for you to produce, you need to have uh, alternatives. Okay? So instead of uh, buying uh, the expensive materials on this setup, I intend to choose black bag for this one and a coco choir because black bag is only cheap materials and then coco peat is also cheap material. And then I choose uh, drip irrigation, drip type of irrigation because once you have turned it on, and then the water will flow up to the end number two was according to episode two according to uh, our idols out there who grew bell peppers they need they have a standard on how to operate on how to take good care of this plant you should follow those standards it's because they just uh, made a scientific study on that and then they proven already let me say if you choose to have a two stem pattern you should follow that if they choose a standard that the, this uh, bell pepper uh, you have to wait to cut this stem until the bell pepper will size as a pea size okay or a mongo size or a bean size now you should follow that one so again they are proving it already they proved that already once they study it you should follow because once you didn't follow that one that suggestion or that uh, uh, that practice it wouldn't be able to lose uh, days your days are gone, your fertilizer, your nutrients will be go to waste, okay? So this is a, I think a pea size uh, bell pepper. So they don't recommend this one because of these two on top, two bell peppers on top. They will have to, uh, I think, this fruit will have, uh, will get trouble when absorption of nutrients. But I guess uh, we need to testing this one. So uh, let's find out if those practices will have the result. Or even though they have a result already, but uh, I need a. Uh, hands-on experience about this one okay well of course I don't have this type of uh, setup or system with this kind on the side so I remove this at the middle and then first fruit okay and then second fruit all right so we will remove the other one uh, we will maintain the two stems system in this bell pepper as they recommended.
I I managed to have this on this area and then that area at the back I intend to follow my uh, ability or instinct that at some point of time maybe I choose to have this way in order for me to experience but that experience is also a lesson that you should have if the standard is there you should follow because once you follow everything will go to correct way Don't worry guys, we're still here, the plants are still there, we manage or we have an action on how to prevent fruit flies and hopefully this bell pepper will mature 25 days from now or 30 days from now Okay, and then we will have to upload another episode on how we Hopefully successful harvest the apple size bell pepper.